So hello again everyone, this is Jack and this is my Jam 12 game. Uh, I've added a few, well quite a few things now that are new. Uh, I'll get thrown straight into it but I'll try and explain and play at the same time. So I've added in a jump in, that's one cool thing. And obviously as you can see enemies are shooting back at me. Um, enemy bullets, uh, better graphics. I've, I've Played with the carriage a little bit, and yep, uh, it now tells you when you've cleared the train. So, when you've killed all the, en all the enemies on a train, you get that little bonus, and you'll get extra points for doing that. Um, it'll also, when you've cleared the train, it'll also slow down to a stop, so that so that you can't just keep going on like this. So you have to actually switch train because it will just slow to a stop and blow up or something, and. Jump into other trains, it's quite cool. Also, when you land on a carriage, it destroys all the enemies on it. So it has this sort of tactic of it's better to sort of hip hop like that. Hippity hop. And capture it all. Oh, sh ah, okay, I missed it. <laughs> it's actually really difficult. Here we go. No. Okay, I won't mess it up this time. Sometimes you get a long train, sometimes you get a short train, and you can't always tell. Let's see, that was a short one. Let's wait for the next one. I've got a little character animation in there as well now, like he has little little feet. There we go. Wow. So I want to capture this. No, too short. <laughs> You get used to it. Yeah, it's really weird. But yeah. So yeah, the objective will just be to do this and you'll level up every now and then. So when you level up, it will I think it, I'll think I'll do it in a way that it just stops the um train spawning until you've sort of completed your options. So it'll, you'll level up and you'll get a couple of options that appear up here for, you know, your next, you know, upgrade or research or something. And you'll get to do that. And once you've done that, when you've selected one, it'll go back to the game. Ah, oh, missed it. Let's get it. Whee. Ah. Sometimes it works perfectly and you get two going side by side in exactly the same speed. It's quite easy to jump across them at that point. Right, here we go, here we go. Oh, I died. I wasn't looking. See, that's a fast train, I don't want to try and grab that. So I, th I think I'll slow these speeds down um, to start off with. So that you'll, you'll start off with slow trains and fewer enemies and it'll just quickly ramp up. Also, um, as you can see, like different colours of the locomotives. I mean, they're still just boxes, but they represent <coughs> um, the steam and diesel and electric trains. I just haven't got around to drawing them yet. Also, I'm going to give. Um, they have different levels of enemies, so they don't all just have these bullet guns because they're pretty useless. Because the bullets adapt the speed of the train they're moving on, so when they actually aim at you. If they're moving like, too fast in the opposite direction or something, the bullet will just completely miss you. Okay, I'm playing really bad. I'm usually better at this. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I'm going to make it so you get your health back as well when you capture a train, just because it goes down so quickly. <coughs> so he's got, yeah, he's got little leg animations and he rotates. Um, 
I didn't do any sort of like nice rotation, it's just left and right, but it works well enough I think. And the enemies will have the same thing. To be honest, you're paying so much attention to how you're moving that you don't really look at the animation too much. Oh, no, 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 yes. Just stay on. Let's get this one. So, uh. Whew. Once you get into the flow of it, it's, it's pretty fun. It's just... I think it just needs to be slower to start off with to get you into that groove. So yeah, you will, you can't jump on the trains at the moment, but you will be able to. And yeah, I'm going to have to design the uh, steam train in such a way that you can actually walk on it. And it looks right, because it'll have lots of bits sticking out of it. And I've got to do something. Oh no, no. Yeah, once you've cleared trains and they slow to a stop, they'll go off screen quicker. So you, that won't actually happen. Because at the moment you just get them lagging behind with nobody on them at the same speed. So you, they never get destroyed. Let's, oh, can't get on it. Let's go on this one. Yes. Ah. Oh well, um, that's how much I've got so far. Um, I think the weapons and like the different weapons and the whole upgrade tree is my next priority. I mean, there's other stuff to do, but I think that's a priority because that's like the other big main section of it. So I think that will mostly be Sunday, and then Monday will just be polishing it all up and maybe. It, probably finishing off art bits. Oh, damn. Okay. But, you know, I hope you enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching, and bye.